Hey, welcome to Risk Live. I'm a grandmaster at this game. <clears throat> we are playing Europe Advance, Progressive Capitals. We hopped into somebody else's lobby. Hopefully this is the uh, meta settings that we like. We got fog and blizzards. And it is automated bots. All right. No alliances. Everything looks good. We are in the sixth position. All right. What do we have? We are pink. We've got a middle spot with a four. And when we go last, that's where we want to cap. That looks like a good one. Noob corner potential, but uh, I think I'd rather take the middle, being in the last position. We've got blizzards here, make Italy attractive. One point hold down here on West Africa for somebody, red or whoever has Andalusia. Could be a one point hold all the way out to Gascony. Black takes Russia. And he's got a ton of material up here. Nope. Let's uh, race. Green goes for the Gascony. One point hold. Uh, one point hold on Orient as well. Man, okay, we are going to be surrounded by people in pockets. So, our goal is hold the middle bonus. Maybe we can get noob corner, but uh, hold the middle bonus, keep our cap strong. And hopefully people will fight all around us, and we have cards to take forever. The challenge is eh, our cap is not out here. So if we hold our bonus, our cap is basically trapped. Though not necessarily. White. White is Captain Andalusia, it looks like. So green is going to have a hard time. Green's going to have to take France. And then push down. And he's got to hope he has a position down in here, too. So one, two, three, four, five, and probably somebody here for six. So nobody's in the noob corner. Hey, Jay. Welcome to the new season. Purple's over here. I don't mind letting you hold. I'm going to have to have good neighbors. Going to have to have good neighbors. Purple's going to be strong. You're good. Take it. Oh, geez. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, green's about to find out. So red had to hit something weak. We can't defend two caps with people getting all this stuff. So we gonna let, we're going to let red survive. Come on. 
Come on, dice. Thank you. Green took it over there. Green took Iceland. We'll see if he pushes out this way or if he just goes for France. Mm, White's taking a long time to think. He's got to finish this pocket, otherwise, he's maybe he's given up already. <laughs> he knows Green was here. are they doing they're giving up already huh well that's sad that's gonna put green in a strong position unless we can take that maybe we can take it they're still here they just card skipped Hey, Nate B. Connections have been sucking for a few days, so mostly watching my videos in low quality. Oh, that's a bummer. Live isn't working. Huh. We are at six members at the moment. Six, and uh, hopefully growing. Now, we are going to start our new challenge this today, later on today, after this, after this stream. And what I'm going to do with it, we're going to do zombies. But I'm going to do it as a members-only live stream. That way, one, it will help to serve as a member drive. But two, we won't get stream snipers while I'm doing my challenge. So we're going to do the All Maps Zombie Challenge. If you're interested in watching, make sure to join as a member. Otherwise, they, they will all eventually be released. You don't have to join as a member to see it. But they will be released at some point in the proper order <laughs> on the channel it'll just take a while to play out so if you can't wait oh green green all right we're gonna have to take this cap behind you then and he gets perfect dice absolutely perfect dice Hmm. Black must not have gotten Russia on their first turn. They didn't. Don't really want to commit more in here if we're going to lose it. White does bot out. I don't want him near me. Keep my cap strong. Okay, White decided they are going to be here. Well, they are quickly going to be trapped behind green. Now, so we're going to play good neighbor. We're going to play good neighbor from the middle. We're going to have a strong cap 
cards to take. Black adds in behind purple. You like to see that. Purple's getting 12. Purple must have a bunch of territory. Purple's going to wipe black out of that pocket right now. I don't think black put enough in there. Nobody's in noob corner. Nobody's capped in noob corner. So I originally took UK. Green just knocked me out of it. So here's what it looks like. These are the caps we've seen. And then these are where we think people are. But it's unconfirmed. So there's everybody. Why is not clearing out that pocket very quickly? You can't see the shapes. Oh, <laughs> let me fix that. There we go. There's our, uh, there's the caps we know, and there's the caps that we suspect that we haven't seen yet. We did, we did. I think we finished it at, um, what was it, 60 something? Hang on a second. Let's take a look. Finished it at 63. Not too bad, not too bad. Purple finished. Ah, I was thinking of going behind here. But I think I got to worry about out here. Purple's going to have the strength. to push out from here. Could have been, it was close. It was close. Hey, New Mexico. won your first game you were 34 on the leaderboard nice hey that's that's a good place to start
white might end up giving up with purple back here. So here's the thinking. Purple's going to get strong. He's going to have two pockets. If I fight with green, which by all rights I probably should because he's knocked me out of here, but if he's strong enough to defend this, then that's troops purple is going to have to go through at some point. And it gives green someone to fight down there. Yes, yes, that was a good that was a good comeback from that disastrous day that we don't speak about. <laughs> okay, black holding his bonus. Nice. Black fighting with green. That works out. Purple is growing. He should be taking this bonus and sitting right against White's cap. still here but I don't know that he's going to be here for very long and green has no idea what's coming because he was not back there White's still here. Going into purple. Maybe. He definitely doesn't have a bonus. Black trades in early. Is he going to go into green? So I think uh, white did break the bonus, but now purple takes his cap. Yep, he got him. So I was going to get the second biggest trade because white had accidentally card skipped. <laughs> Don't know why they did. Had they not card skipped, they might have survived that because they would have had a trade. It would have been a weak trade, though. It was bound to happen. But now we get the big trade. And green is weak on cap. Green is going to lose that cap real soon. If he doesn't get troops on it. Boy, where is he putting his troops? He's trying to protect his bonuses. Okay, that's a little better.
Boy, Black has a lot of troops off camp. Reds equal to my troop count? No. Maybe before, maybe after he traded, but before I traded. <laughs> Purple's going to be big. Oh, I didn't get the big trade because purple. Oh, no. Purple got the kill. So they get the first set at 20. And uh, <laughs> they take green's cap. Purple. It's going to be hard for purple to lose this game. It is going to be hard for Purple to lose this game at this point. He's not taking Green's cap yet. Um, no, we can't block Green easily. But we're not worried about blocking Green. Purple is the threat. <laughs> Purple is the board threat. Okay, green got to hold. You better put troops on your cap, buddy. You better put troops on your cap. Oh my goodness. Dude's trying to protect his bonus. <laughs> oh my goodness. Black's cap is still super weak. Yeah, but I'm not worried about breaking. I'm not worried about blocking green. Even if he breaks our bonuses, he needs troops to be able to fight against purple. Purple's going to roll out of there. Or or roll this way and start hurting everybody over here. Either way is fine. No, this 15 is a blocker. It protects this side of him. So it's not like this is just not there for a reason. But he is starting to expand. He wants this bonus, it looks like. You hold grudges? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with holding a grudge. Does purple take green's cap? Or is purple breaking black? Can't tell. Green, start with 19. All right. Oh, man. Did he go into purple? Let's hope so. I think I'm going to hold this bonus for very much longer. So we're going to start to pull those troops back in.
All right, green should have a pretty good defense mounted over here. Might not be enough. Never hard to lose a game. Easiest thing in the world, even when you think it's in the bag. That's right. One bad roll. Overextending and a bad roll. Missing a kill. Okay, Black finally has some troops on his cap. Purple and green might just be trading over there. Black finishes bonus. Knock red out of there. Yep. Nah, I don't care. <clears throat> Black's going to fight purple. <laughs> it's not a big deal. So my job from the middle is not to be board police. My job is to have a strong enough cap that I can't die. So I'm going to try not to get into conflicts. I want trades. Red might retaliate on black. So red broke my my small bonus in order to retaliate on black. Nothing wrong with that. I should have pulled that four back though. <laughs> I was thinking I should have pulled the four back. Yeah, I mean, it is, it's four, it's four territories to protect. This one's three. This one's four, and it's only four points. Now, why did black break me there? 
kind of strange. He breaks purple too, though. <laughs> so we'll let other people respond to that. I would like to hit here and see if that's purple's cap that got opened or did purple cap here because if he capped here he can be card blocked in two spots without that bonus some defense here. Or is it offense? Guess we won't take a look at it just yet. Let's see what black does. Feeling good about the cap. Purple has a ton of troops, likely stacked on two caps. Black. He held his two bonuses, it fulfilled his dreams, and uh, he's able to bot out? No. <laughs> Oh, great. He's forcing red to hit me. Now me and Red can just trade in in his bonus. And let those guys all fight each other. Now I'm kind of enjoying seeing this uh, play out. Purple takes his bonus back here. No. I wonder if he's wanting his cap open here.
Green getting 20. So he's expanded a little bit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. He's gotten two territories in here. There's Purple's cap. So we know where Purple's cap is, original. It does not protect that bonus. It does not protect the pocket. That's good to know. Figure this cap is probably a little weaker than this cap that he has over here. Or it might be equal. <clears throat> Black could swing around here and break. Black's taking a long time to think. bought it no he just missed taking a card he might be having connection issues So if Red wants to go through with his cap, he can. I don't think he will. Seems like more of a patient player, other than re retaliating to black. Green's going to come expand, okay? It's 
That's all right. He's got to expand somewhere. Did green start with 20 still? So neither him or purple own this territory, this continent. Red gets to keep his bonus, he's going to start to catch up to me. Little by little, we're quite a bit ahead. Alright, get greedy, green. Go ham. So black and green playing nice up here together which is just a little bit surprising considering their expansionary tendencies. But uh, I think it'll boil. It'll come to a boil and we should see some pretty good action. And basically that's what me and Red are waiting for. Which is essentially what we have to do from the middle. Hold a bonus if you can. Have a strong cap, wait for opportunities. And the opportunities will arise when the other big guys all hit each other. Now, if one of them starts stacking on us and thinking they're going to kill us, then we take them out. And you card block them immediately. Blacks on my cap, and he's like, uh oh, <laughs> retreat, retreat. Keep going, go into green, keep going. Keep going. Aww.
This is an interesting one. It's going to boil to a head at some point. Can't play good neighbor forever. I think we go open purple scap. Purple's letting green hold this, which is forcing green out this way. I wonder if purple ends up setting the card block here. could he could set a card block on green right there probably do it on his trade in so if he attacks here he's gearing up for it if he takes both of them then he's still playing passive. Yeah, taking a look. Making sure that it's still what he thinks it is. If I hit here, he can come through here without breaking black. But if I don't hit here, he's going to have to break black. <laughs> Do we make it easy on him? Allow him to not break black? Yeah, he's probably not going to go there anyways. We'll go ahead and make it easy. to cap.
Yep, all quiet. <laughs> We've got to bide our time. That's just the position we were in. When you're in a when you're in a game where there's multiple pockets. So we've got a pocket here. This one can get broken, but a pocket here, potentially massive pocket. You got to play it a little bit different. Now, had we had we had the opportunity to hold this and get in here before purple, we could have done that. And then if we got this pocket, uh, having a pocket and the outside cap, winning position. You can be more aggressive. Hard to get card blocked if you have a cap out here. Not impossible if, if you make enemies of everybody. wonder if black wants to force purple to close this cap here. Ah, purple breaks screen over here to get a card. Uh, I think green's cap is probably really strong. 300 at least. He's got a bunch off cap. But he's been getting a big bonus every single turn. Bigger than what we were getting. Green started with 22. Does that mean purple didn't break him there? Basically, me and red have made green purple's problem. Since purple's been getting the most. Purple and black. Because green has to go... Well, green can continue to just trade right here. Or he can go into black. Meanwhile, Green's thinking he's uh, he's winning, but he's such an easy card block. <laughs> he's such an easy card block. Maybe he realizes it. That's why he has such big stacks over here. So black probably has the biggest cap at this point. Unless he's got a bunch of troops protecting against green over here. Because it looks like he pulled everything back. And he's been getting 22 per turn for a long time. Hasn't hit any big stack. So I'm guessing he's got the biggest cap. Green 
only has one cap, but he's got a bunch of troops off cap. So he probably has the second, no, not the second biggest cap. I think it's probably me with the second biggest cap. Then red, then green, and then purple. Although it's possible purple's been concentrating more on the one cap, and this cap might be bigger. Boy, black takes for freaking ever. Blocks red into green. That's good. Nope, purple's attacking. Going after green or black. It's got to be going through black. No, black's not a bot. He just... He's, he's done that multiple times. I wonder if purple went around through black to get to green and it's basically hitting everything in green. Red attacked off of his cap. Red's looking to take some advantage here. Now purple must have attacked from here. We've got to take a look, right? We have to take a look. Because if we get this cap, we have this pocket protected by... Uh, somebody opens both caps to get into that pocket. That's possible. Red just went through... Or, I mean, purple just went through and hit a bunch of ones. Yeah, green lost everything. We have a trade. We could trade early and take that cap. If we get purple out of here, purple is stuck back here behind green. How cool would that be? Oh, look at that. We get it for free. We get it for free. Guard. It's a good thing green didn't come around and look. What are you doing, Black? Now I gotta break you. I guess we go to war. Is he gonna leave that 300 stack here? 
Nope, but it gets trapped back there. I wonder if purple double tapped that cap and won it from green. Green might be killable. Red needs to come take a look. Green still has a cap, it seems. So now red has the strongest cap, and people are fighting. We need purple cleared out of this side. Hopefully black gets purple cleared out. Red's going to trade, purple's going to trade in. Does all of that go out here? It should. Wow, he didn't trade. Black has a kill card on purple right here with that stack. So black managed to grab all of that, all of that.
Black acting like the white player yesterday. Unpredictable. He's keeping that stack back here. Don't know if purple got knocked out of here or not. But that'll be smart if he has a kill guard on him right there. Because that was a big stack. Way bigger than a trade. Alright, red's pushing back on black. Good. Is red keeping a kill guard on... Or, I mean, is red keeping green blocked in here? What's the purpose of this? Did green not get a card last time? Ooh, black scaps open. That could be trouble. That could be trouble. I wonder what black has on that cap. He's got 300 or so off of it. No trade on three for us. Does he pull out that 300 stack? Yes. Oh good, we have a trade. I need this cap stronger. He's going to come attack with that. Might hit red. And then we can take back the Orient. We're going to take a look at Black's cap, too. Green is getting cards. So is purple. Purple and green must be trading together. That is not a very big cap. That is not a very big cap. He needs those troops back on it. I can't afford to slam my caps. So pretty similar number of troops for me and black it looks like. He's got a little bit more than us, most likely. Eh, actually, it's probably really similar, but he's he hasn't traded in yet, so he will have more than us. Red, get an 18. Green. 
green on five. Apparently Black just wants to keep me from getting this bonus for some reason. Unless he's trading with purple in here. Which is a possibility. Black. It's a bold move. Both super weak if I take that out. We'll see if it's all bonuses for him and none for me. And if so, then we're definitely at war. Yep, you're right, Nate. I mean, I, I expected that. I expected that's what he would do. What are you doing? Break red? No. But he broke my bonus here. I get that one though. That one's a that one's a nice bonus. We can work with that. We'll retake this one. It gives him an attack stack that can go out. Hey, Rick. Green held France. All right, if I trade now, it's a difference of five. Unless black trades early. He's got cards here he can take. And if he needs to go attack somebody, he can.
Great. And he's going to take all of his time, and he's going to break me with one of these stacks. <laughs> That's his M.O. He misses a card. He's actually offline. He'll come back, I would think. He must just be having connection issues. That's going to suck, though, because, well, we can't really defend three caps. And this is going to just stick to us. And we won't get to hold any bonuses. What's weird is it looked like it traded him in, but then it didn't. It's that weird glitch. It says it traded him in, but it didn't actually trade him in. And we would have seen a lot more troops spread out among these if he did trade in. Purple card blocked? Wasn't paying attention. Okay, blacks offline. Was Red's chance to get a second cap? Black breaks me. And this one probably comes down and sur this cap is going to be surrounded by massive stacks. Oh, it went up. That's good. So far, so good. I wonder who's up here, though. Red. Red's up here. Red gets to sneak around. Go that way. Black's back. <laughs> and he didn't get a fortify in. He came back, and he didn't get a fortify in. Okay. That cap, I think we take that cap and we'll leave this one. Because if black does bot out again, we don't have to worry about this. Looks like purple is card blocked. Haha, <laughs> excellent. Excellent. Purple's getting 17, so uh, green has card blocked him in here by not trading with him. And purple's given up. Black, you can have that cap if you're here.
Hopefully he doesn't get mad and suicide into me for switching caps with him. That was not my intention. Red could come in and take that, but then he's got to deal with this. He might come look. He should have seen that I went to three caps. Hopefully he doesn't hit this cap. All right, black's still offline. We'll let this move through, and then we'll try and come back. Once that moves through, we'll try and come back, although I'll probably be stacked all against me up here. I'm going to have to hit through here. No trade on four. Unfortunate. So this should move through and stick to this cap. Hmm. If it holds on that cap, I mean, I'm fine with that too, I guess. wants to protect that bonus. Oh, purple got a card. Green's trading with purple. Maybe he's getting ready to kill him. Purple's back. Purple went offline, but purple is back. So maybe purple did a fake bot out there. I think purple did a fake bot out. Thanks, Red. Very good. <laughs> yeah, you can't get through. You can't get through there. He can with his cap, though. And maybe Black steps off of that. Gives him a chance to take it. I can't defend three caps. I mean, I kind of can. I only need 400 over here. But you don't really want to be split in such a way that uh, somebody can easily steal one of them, whichever one they want. We do have a trade, though. So if Black does step off of this and leaves it weak, we can take it. Let's see what he does. This might end up 
and going this way. This can clog up all of that. Red does go before us. So I kind of hope black stays on that cap for a little bit longer. Nope. He's off the cap. Did he? He didn't leave red in here, I don't think. Now that's a lot of troops to get through. This is a, this is potentially a cheap path to get in here. Does he just go through the 141, or does he peek? Nice, nice. He gets it. Well played. Him having two caps means I'm not as threatened here. He still has a couple hundred troops in here. Okay, so he went through with 1,300, so he's got 800 back. Hmm. Hmm. How great would it be to take this cap from red? Trap him in here. He's got 800 here. Green gets the purple kill. Well done. So now green has that pocket, and he's going to work out. If he takes that one from red, that would be ideal. I think we'll wait. I think we will wait and see. Or should we go look at that cap right now? Did green trade in with that kill? Yes, that cap's not going to be takeable. At least not for us. I don't have a cap open to it. Red with a 101 stack there. Okay. Green's going to have to come out. So I opened his cap so he can come out and wreck red if he wants to. Red's got trades in here with the black bot. Black traded in. gonna try and block green yes no he doesn't he just comes back to cap <laughs> all right ok 
Okay, green is now card blockable. Oh, it was one off. So red can see this and can put troops here to block green. Green's on two cards. This is, it doesn't get any any um, clearer a time to set the block than right now. Hey, Sofa. Yeah, that was crazy game, wasn't it? Well played. So Red knows what he's doing. Green has to pull out to this spot. Otherwise, he's up against the cap. And he doesn't do anything. trade. We'll see what green ends up doing. it would be great if green bots out and the bot moves into here because then I can sneak in and take it. And then I get the pocket. That's what we're gearing up for. So green had a thousand on cap. That's the number we're going off of. It goes up by 17 per turn. 19? 20. Goes up by 20 per turn. So every five turns he gets a hundred. Uh well, black's a bot. Black's a bot. <laughs> And I'm and I'm not trying to card block red <laughs> with that stack. We're card blocking green. Yeah, makes a lot more sense. <laughs> trade no trade this black bot's gonna get big
Should have slider blitz that. Lost five attack in a one. Stupid. <laughs> Black getting 22. Black's going to be breaking into red's bonuses up here. And surrounding this cap, <laughs> which is what we wanted to see. Okay, red could be retaken up here, or you could be taking this. I think he's taking Orient. Mm, that wasn't that. That wasn't enough tax to take Orient. Nah, he went up here. Okay, cool. Green botted. Yes, green botted. We have a trade. Where does the bot pull off to? He can only go to one side. And we go through the other side. Sweet. Now, I need more troops there. Love it. Love it. Green is out. He will not hit that cap. Red doesn't have enough to hit that cap, even if he trades. Shouldn't hit this one either. We're in a good spot. We've got the kill guard on green. We're going to wipe green out of everywhere there, except for right here. One point hold. And that'll get us some bonuses. Red's going to have to pull this back to cap. Otherwise, that green stack will destroy it. And green might end up stacking in here and protecting me. Okay, he's going for a second. That tells me he's going to go for a second. He wants to get the kill on black? No. He is going to start smacking the bot, so... I think he knew with me getting this that he wasn't going to be able to beat me. Okay, well played, well played. Yep. Yep, this one should be in the bag. up. I was supposed to leave it right down there. 
Green could trade in and go right behind us with that trade. He might not, because he doesn't have anything in here. He doesn't have any of this bonus. So there's not really a strategic reason that it would put in here if it trades on three. If green goes to four cards, we could kill him. No, I don't have a freaking trade. <laughs> well, it'll give us a double trade. It'll give us a double trade if it goes to four cards. I think I have enough up here. He had a thousand troops, though. We can kill him, because I can circle around. Yeah, we'll kill green. Double trade gives us... Ah, oh shoot, that only gives us 600 if I double trade. Maybe I'll just get rid of this kill guard. I don't think we need it. And it risks the backside here. Show some good faith to Red. But I'm going to help him take out some of the bot. He's going to have to do most of the work. If he's conceding to get second place, which, which clearly that's what it looks like. He still has a ton of troops on this cap, though. Black's getting 11, so Black's still holding Orient. Red might kill black now that black's on three cards. It would trade him in. He could go for the kill on both bots, actually. Green's on four. He could go for the kill on both bots. And that'll put him in a good position, actually. <laughs> that could put him in a really good position. Although it's it's a thousand troops he has to hit with green. Let's hope green goes to five. Because then we kill green right now. Ah, he doesn't. He doesn't. He did have enough, yeah. Because he's got like a, over a thousand troops on this cap. But with his trade-in, he would have had a 1,000 here that he could have gone up and killed green with. With both caps, he could have killed black, I think. So I want my bonuses, but we're doing some work here, too. I'm not going to leave myself too weak that we can't beat red afterward. 
but we'll do a little bit of work on the bots. Yeah, you should have killed black on the last one. Now that I have this bonus, black will break it. Yeah, yeah, I get that. I mean, I gave him fist bumps, and he saw me hit the bot. So I've indicated to him that I'm going to give him second. What he needs to worry about is not losing a cap to the bot. If he doesn't, if he keeps a cap, he gets second. If he doesn't keep a cap, if he gets too low and loses his caps, he can't get second. It's impossible. Wow, that was his cap. He might have split some troops off, but that might have been his cap. Okay, green's on three cards. Eh, he's still got a thousand plus troops here. He's going to come through and break me. And he didn't break me. It's coming, though. It's coming. Jesus, he still has that there, huh? So if red hit and split off of this, he could still have a lot here, but he might have hit a bunch of black, and this cap might be weak. In fact, what he should do is just come off of that cap, single stack. and let the bot roll through. Oh wow, maybe he lost that cap to the bot. No, he didn't. Okay, what's black on? Black's on two cards. Red goes for the black kill on three. Green is on four cards. Green has, and we're on four cards. It will trade us in. So eight, nine. He's got over a thousand troops. It's definitely a loser to kill it. But we can do it from this position. Nope, we can't. We can pull back from this position, though, to this cap. Although we don't even need to because we'll trade in again. Hmm. want to do too much work on the bot. I need to make sure that I get the win. Green goes to five cards. We kill it. It was a little risky. 
It was a little risky to only win 300 some odd troops and take out over a thousand. But, see, right now, red could kill black and green. Eh, be, actually, it'd be questionable. He, he might be able to. He might be able to. He's open to be able to. Don't know how, if, he, if he has enough to kill black. He does have enough to kill green. So he's going to trade. He could kill green right here. Attacker's advantage you expect to lose about two-thirds when attacking off cap. Not necessarily. I've never seen it that that be like the norm. All right, he's going for the black kill. You got it. He hasn't seen this stack up here. But he's got enough. Oh, you better hurry. He's trying to slider blitz, I think, to make sure he doesn't lose too much. He didn't kill him. Okay. He's letting me kill him. He's letting me kill him. And, and green's on five cards. We kill them both, game over. We kill them both, game over. Now, he might have a guard in North Africa, but I doubt it. No guard. I don't think I can kill it. <laughs> I lost 62. Well, he can't cap run. <laughs> we have a trade too, so... You might as well take a look. I could have messed it up and not gone back to cap. <laughs> well played. Oh, I don't have any emojis on this one. Subscribe to the See if we can get the world dumb. GG's. Yeah, we got it. That was a good game. That was a good game. Woo. Ha <laughs> ha.
Master, Grandmaster, Master, Strongfield, well played. All right. So this was our uh, second account that we're playing this on. <laughs> First, we actually, I thought I was in Grandmaster on the last season, but apparently I was on, I, I was Master. Or maybe I fell under. I don't know. That was weird. So we've got some work to do this season. We're going to get back up to Grandmaster on this account. And uh, here's how it's going to go. Um, we are going to... I'm going to stop this live stream. I'm going to start another live stream. And we are going to start our All Maps Zombie Challenge with my main account. So I'm going to be playing Europe Advanced or hopping into other lobbies on this account. Climb back up to Grandmaster. And on the main account, we're going to do all the maps with zombies. Um, but those that stream is going to be members only. So all those all my zombie games, the All Maps Challenge with zombies, will end up getting put up on the channel for public consumption. You don't have to be a member to watch it, but you got to wait until it gets into the the feed. 